arrival of the coronavirus changed many parts of community life, including school attendance and access to religious services. Your markets may even have closed. Having access to food and products at a local market is important for your family. If safe practices are not followed, the marketplace could increase coronavirus spread, which could force it to close. Following the actions in this video can help you stay safe from coronavirus while shopping, which will also help keep the markets open. The coronavirus can spread whenever an infected person breathes, talks, coughs, or sneezes by releasing germs into the air that cannot be seen. These germs can float in the air for several hours, and if they reach a person's nose or mouth, that person can become infected. People can have COVID-19, feel fine, and do not know they are sick. They can unknowingly spread the disease. That is why it is important to follow local government guidelines designed to stop the spread of the disease. There are three things we can all do to slow the spread of coronavirus in our community. First, properly wearing a clean mask that snugly covers your mouth and nose helps reduce coronavirus germs from being released into the air. Wearing a mask can also reduce your chance of inhaling these germs and help everyone in your community stay healthy. Second, washing your hands often for at least 20 seconds with soap and water will eliminate germs. If available, be sure to use a paper towel to turn off the water or you may put germs back onto your clean hands. If you cannot wash your hands, regularly use hand sanitizer for at least 20 seconds. Avoid touching your mouth, nose or eyes as possible. Third, distance yourself from others not part of your household by 2 meters, which is a bit more than 2 arms length or by the distance recommended by your local authorities. This distance can reduce exposure to coronavirus droplets in the air from infected people. In addition to these three actions, let's talk about simple things you can do as a shopper to help keep your community a safe place to shop during this pandemic. Before leaving home, plan what you buy so you can shop quickly. Make a list. Choose a time to shop at the market when it is less busy. If your children can be safely cared for elsewhere, do not bring them to the market. If you feel sick or you have a fever, do not go to the market. If a household member has COVID-19 or feels sick or feverish, stay home because you might unknowingly be infected too. Do not go to the market and risk spreading illness, especially COVID-19, to others. Ask a friend or a neighbor to purchase the market item you want. When traveling to the market, wear a clean mask and do not touch your face. If walking with others, make sure all wear masks and keep two meters distance apart or by the distance recommended by your local authorities. Never remove your mask, even more to be heard easily. Coronavirus spread more easily when people are on mask. Do not greet anyone with a hug or a handshake during this pandemic. Greet others from two meters apart or by the distance recommended by your local authorities. When shopping at the market, avoid unnecessary touching of products. Shop by looking and pointing, not touching. Do not use utensils shared by others. Only the vendor should touch products and utensils. This can seem difficult, but it is the safest practice. Do not eat anything or accept samples at the market. All prepared samples should be packed in to go containers to be eaten at home. If available, use hand sanitizer or hand washing station each vendor. Purchase as many products as you can safely store at home so that you can limit trips to the market. When arriving home, wash your hands at least 20 seconds with soap and water. Remember, to stay safe in the market's place. Properly wear a clean, snugly fitted mask at all times. Wash your hands with soap and water often. If soap and water are not available, use hand sanitizer. Keep a physical distance of two meters between yourself and the others, or by the distance recommended by your local authorities. Do not remove your mask while speaking. Do not bring your children to the market. Stay home if anyone in your household is sick or feverish. 
the more of these actions each of us follows, the less likely coronavirus will spread in your marketplace and the more you can keep each other safe in our community.